Ivan Saric beat Antipov with the black pieces and is now on 5 out of 6. Let's find out what happened in the game. Ivan, a very nice win with the black pieces at a critical stage in the event. Your thoughts about today's game? Yeah, my opponent surprised me a little bit. He played first move knight f3. He's a usually e4 player. And uh, I responded with uh, some sort of uh, Greenfeld setup, which I played a long time ago. And I think he didn't expect uh, this uh, plan in which uh, I kept my knight on g8. And then uh, instead of just playing knight f6, knight d5, which is usually a team in the Greenfeld, I went knight h6 and then knight f5 and uh, quickly obtained control of the d4. And I, in that moment, black was already fine and I, I had a pleasant position right from the beginning of the game. And uh, eventually, when I thought I'm just slightly better, the game will enter some uh, end game or something like that. Uh, my opponent uh, allowed me to, to make a break with the move c4. And uh, after this, uh, the game was just over. Right, but is it uh, difficult to deal uh, when you've prepared something and your opponent plays something else so early on in the opening? Uh, how do you deal with that? No, I was just happy that I don't need to play all the forced lines in the game because I'm, I like when the game starts so early. No, it's, it's, it's something that you must do and uh, it's something that uh, you know, ki keep, keeps you safe and also it's something that uh, most of the chess professionals now work on. You just need to work so much on the openings and uh, when when just from the beginning you have, uh, you know that you know knight f3 is not really some uh, dangerous line. You, you won't lose in 20 moves with black normally. Yeah, it's gonna be a long game nor normally. And the last position we saw a lot of geometry with pins all over the board. Yeah, I'm uh, pinned down, but uh, he's completely pinned and uh, he's losing uh, way more material than uh, to even continue the game. It's just uh, over uh, immediately. Right, well, it's been a good day for you with a quick win. Any plans for the evening? Uh, no, not really. <laughs> I'm just trying to rest and uh, try not to repeat the, the last year because I think uh, I also had five out of six, as I remember. And then I had uh, one unlucky loss against Havel. And uh, after that, I lost another game and it was uh, over. So I just hope that I won't repeat the same mistakes like last year. Right, and how would you evaluate your place so far? Uh, I think I've been playing pretty good. Uh, actually, only problems I had with uh, against female chess players, I've I've made a true draws, and uh, against men, uh, I've won all my games. So, so I hope I think uh, now, yeah, it's apparently no chance even to to play against some women. So next round, so it's okay. You sound relieved about that. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Right, now you don't often play against uh, women players in your calendar. What's the experience like uh, to be here to play against them when they're so motivated due to the high prize fund? Yeah, normally the only opportunity is if they play European individual championships. Uh, otherwise, uh, yeah, it's very rarely that I play against women. And uh, here are almost all best women in the world. Yeah, here you, we have a world champion and uh, also, I think, yeah, women world rapid and blitz champion. So it's uh, it's a tough game and uh, it's a different style of chess. I think against women that they, they play more solid chess. You know, they are not uh, taking so much risks as the men. I think. Right now, are you aware that yesterday at the battle of the sexes, in fact, the women team beat the men team? Yeah, yeah, I'm aware of that. <laughs> Right, okay, and give us some impressions about playing here in Gibraltar. Yeah, I like it. Uh, I've been uh, last year and uh, I, I like it, the tournament and uh, so I hope I will come also in future here again. Uh, it's, it's nice, you can visit some Gibraltar, you can visit Spain and uh, there are a lot of... Uh, if you combine those things, you can find uh, something in both countries we, we, which what you like, yeah. We look forward to having you back here, but before that, all the best for the remaining rounds. Hope to have you back in our studio again. Thank you very much. Thanks, Ivan.